Hello everyone and welcome to Stream and Tech Now. Thanks so much for joining me. I've got a real quick video for you today. I had a couple questions that were posed to me asking how do you change the name of a particular file after you download it. So it's really easy. So I thought I'd do a real quick video for you. I'm going to show you how to do it within an Android device coming up next. Okay, so I'm going to show you on my Android phone, and this is a Samsung Note 8, and it's really easy to do this. Now, I'm going to show you how to change the name of a file. Now, there's a myriad of reasons why one would want to change the name. I mean, it makes it easier to locate and search years later, much easier to organize your files. You can put them, you know, you can put your own ID if you want. Um, there are security reasons why you would want to rename your file. So it's, it's a good little skill to know how to do it, and it's really easy. So first thing you need to do is you need to locate the app, whether it's called My Downloads or My Files. Any Android phone is going to have an app like that. Now, on my phone, it's called My Files, and it looks just like this right here. So go ahead and locate that and then open it up. Now I've already downloaded two files and I'm gonna wanna change the name of those files and I'll show you why in just a second. Now I'm gonna show you the long way and then I'm gonna show you the, the short way how we can actually get to those two files. Now all I need to do is go into internal storage right here and then I'm gonna scroll down to downloads. Now again, this is the long way once you find downloads right there download click that and then I'm gonna scroll down to file linked okay that's where I downloaded these two files now as you can see both of these files are just a bunch of different characters and numbers so I want to actually change the name so it's real easy to do that so all you need to do is just push and hold it and then if you look in the top right hand corner you see those three vertical dots if you click that you're presented with this menu and as you can see one of those options is rename so all you need to do is simply click rename and then there you go you can just change the name to whatever you want so I'm gonna go ahead and title it the actual name of the app and then for the purpose of the video I'm just gonna make a version number up I'm gonna say it's 2.2 okay and then I'm gonna click the check and then click rename and then as you can see it just renamed it if I click it again and hold it and click details as you can see it has a brand new name so let me do one more and I'll show you that we'll do this bottom one right here push and hold it click the three vertical dots click rename and then change it to whatever you want I'm gonna go ahead and just name it the actual name of the particular app and then click check rename and there you go so guys that's how easy it is to actually rename um, a particular app now instead of having to go through all of those different steps to actually get to these there's actually a shortcut so let me show you what I mean so next time all I have to do is I actually created this little shortcut that says file link so if I click file link on the bottom here it brings me right to it. So if you want to create that shortcut, it's really easy to do that as well. So let's just go back. And then what we want to do is go into internal storage and I'll show you how to create that shortcut. So just go back down to um, whatever, you know, whatever you want to create a shortcut for. So let's say I want to create a shortcut for um, AZ recorder free. Okay, so this one right up here, I'm gonna create a shortcut for that. So all I need to do is just push and hold it and then click these three vertical dots. And as you can see, it says add shortcut. So I'm gonna click that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put it in my files. Okay, so now watch this. So the next time I go into here, if I scroll down, as you can see on the bottom there, I have that shortcut. And if I click that, that will take me right to those files. So guys, that is just a real quick video to show you how to rename it and also add a shortcut. I hope this was helpful. If so, hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me today, and I'll see you next time on Streaming Tech Now.